Russian military police are stepping in to provide protection in Syria. As statements made by both U.S. and Turkish officials raise questions about when the United States will pull troops out of the region. RT's Rachel Blevins has the story. While there have been conflicting statements from within the Trump administration, the latest rhetoric from White House officials is increasing tensions between NATO allies. During a visit to Israel, White House National Security Advisor John Bolton claimed that the United States would only withdraw troops from Syria if Turkey agreed not to attack Kurdish fighters in the region. Turkey has previously labeled the U.S.-backed Kurdish forces as a terrorist group. And Turkey then announced last month that it was launching a new military offensive to drive the Kurds out of northern Syria after weeks of increasing troops on the border. Bolton's claim that the U.S. expects Turkey to seek peace with the Kurds received a sharp rebuke from President Erdogan. John Bolton çok ciddi bir yanlış yapmıştır. John Bolton has made a very serious mistake. We cannot make any concessions in this regard. And those involved in a terror corridor will receive the necessary punishment. The U.S. officials Mideast tour continued with a stop in Jordan today where Secretary of State Mike Pompeo attempted to reassure allies that a withdrawal of troops from Syria does not change the United States' commitment to combating Iran in the region. The counter-Iran revolution is as, uh, our coalition is as effective today as it was yesterday, and I'm very hopeful it will continue to be effective and even more effective tomorrow. Uh, this is, this is not just about a particular tactic that we take amongst the coalition. In the meantime, Russian military police have started to patrol the area in northern Syria where U.S. troops are expected to leave. With the claim that their goal is to provide security and to control the situation if clashes break out between opposing forces. All the while, tensions in the Middle East continue to increase, and President Trump's promise of a quick withdrawal of U.S. troops from Syria becomes more distant with every condition that is added by his administration. In Washington, Rachel Blevins, RT. Hey, YouTube, thanks for checking out our channel. We hope you enjoyed the video. We have tons of content for you just like this. For more of RT America's one-of-a-kind news and analysis, be sure to subscribe and never stop questioning more.